what was the greatest thing about Legoland? I would have to say, everything was awesome. Everything is awesome. <laughs> What's up guys, I'm Elijah Perkins and this is my wife Pua. Aloha! In this trip, it was Manaya's first time so we wanted to go all out. And so we did seven different parks in six days. Look, if you missed part one, go ahead and re-watch it because this is a continuation. Yes, and we got more things to discuss, we got more parks to talk about, we got more experiences, more tips to share. So here we go. Thursday, we conquered Knott's Berry Farm. So we use ways to navigate our way to Knott's Berry Farm parking. And if we had just followed it to the T, it would have took it would have we would have got lost. So at some point, if you're using an app or map or whatever, you're gonna have to use common sense and look for read the, the signs, signs, read the signs, or follow like where everybody's going. <laughs> like if there's a long line, that's probably the right line for parkings. There's a whole section for kids Manaya's age. Camp Snoopy. Yeah. That's Snoopy. the place to go. You have toddlers, um, young, very young children. Um, Camp Snoopy at Knott's Ferry Farm was the one. We spent pretty much our whole time there. Just yeah, doing tons rides. of rides for Manaya. Yeah. I think there was only one that he kind of cried. I think that one was because he wasn't riding with us. It was literally meant for kids like under 48 inches. And so um, we couldn't go on there with him. He actually went with his auntie Shalom. Yeah, it took him a little bit to get used to, but by the end of the ride, he was smiling. That was another pro. Going with some other kids that are a little bit older, they could ride on some of those rides like that with him. The food was, the food was okay. I'd say it was okay. I had the pizza. The pizza was good. I mean, it's your normal pizza. I mean, I've had bad pizza, so this <laughs> one was, was decent. We did try the churro. Yeah, the churro. <laughs> The churro was yeah, a sure no. Yeah, don't do it. No, it was... just say no to the churro. Yeah. So we got a chicken sandwich from the diner area. And we're like expecting something, was... at least something decent. It was a dried out piece of chicken. It was literally chicken breast. Dried chicken. Dried chicken. Patty. Patty. No. There was no even like... no condiments, <laughs> no lettuce, no tomato, <laughs> no nothing. The bun was like rock solid. Yeah, the yeah, it wasn't very good. So yeah. it could have just been what we got and what we tried, but uh, the food I would say is like uh, it wasn't the best. Yeah, so of course we did take advantage of the soda refill um, and. I think they got some popcorn there too. So that was kind of our staple. I felt like Universal was, was decent. Disney was good. Knott's Berry was like, okay. And then after that kind of just, <laughs> I don't know what happened with this one. They kind of, uh, the quality wasn't there. <laughs> Day four of our trip, we did Legoland. Legoland, cool. let's yeah. talk about it. Right. What was what was the greatest thing about Legoland? I would have to say everything was awesome. Everything is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> everything is cool. <laughs> <laughs> Driving to the parking lot was easy. So by the time we entered the park, it was already almost lunchtime, so we were kind of hungry. Um, and so we, I think they went on one ride. We should have gone to another ride, but I don't know why. We just, like, it was the first one that we were like, let's go on this one, yeah. It was one of those, it looked like a short line, but it took forever just to get on there. And then, I think it was like a safari kind of a feel. Yeah, so after that, I was hungry and I was like, I smell popcorn, let's get some popcorn. We got our souvenir cup and we got our sodas going. I think the Coke was a little... I thought it was okay. Oh, okay. I thought it was like... It didn't, it didn't seem like it was mixed well. 
one of those type of things. Soda, I thought was like, meh. We ended up going to this area that actually had, well, at, the intent at first was to just stop at that one snack park. And then, and then we saw a restaurant called Everything is Ramen. Everything is Ramen. And if you know me, I am queen of ramen. <laughs> that was cool to see. Okay. Yeah, I mean, the, the ramen was okay. Uh, I mean, we come from Hawaii, and so going to like a, a park place, it was good. It just wasn't like up there with the, some of the stuff we tried here in Hawaii. But it was it was decent, I would say that. And then they also had like orange chicken and chow mein for like your kids, and that was good. Okay, so here's, here's the funny part. It said it comes with a side of fruit. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a box of raisins. I so I thought that was a little strange and like misleading. <laughs> like fruits, a little box of raisins. But hey, whatever. <laughs> oh, the burgers and fries. Oh yeah. Oh, the fries were good. Fries were on point. I think fries it was because we had such a bad experience at Knott's Berry Farm that these fries were like, ah. I would say they were like hotel fries. Yeah. Like the, the type of fries you get at like a hotel restaurant. Yeah, they're good. The burgers were good. Um, they had, oh, the the soda places. They had the they had the ones that are like self serve, where you you get to it's like all digital touch screen. You pick what you want, and then the thing comes out. Yeah, it was, that was cool. I don't know why a lot more parks don't have that stuff, but that was cool. Um, lots of fun stuff for the kids, man. So many different things they had. Of course, this is genius, so like a Lego building area, a place where they just have a bunch of Legos where your kids can go and build stuff. I mean, who thinks of that, right? Like <laughs> something that your kid could play at home <laughs> in their room doing. You, they, they go to a big park, spend big bucks just so they can do that. So we have to like yank out some of <laughs> who's a brother and sister like okay come on let's go we can do this at home <laughs> let's go on the ride yeah let's go do the other yeah. stuff that you can't do at home right but that was fun that was cool then they also, area, yeah. yeah in the same spot they had so many different things they had the everything is ramen they had this big splash area for the kids um and then they also had like you know simultaneously they have or throughout the throughout the day they have these different times where this one they had a dance party where one of the characters came out and then some different dancers came out and then they did these dance things mm. and they call it a dance party um, so that was fun but now I got to enjoy mm -hmm. that and then they had these different shows we went to yeah they were kind of like musical shows yeah uh, it was like in an amphitheater the musical like the shows oh, my expectations weren't very high for like a park kind of a show. I mean, except for Disney, of course, maybe. Or some of these other places. But Legoland, I was like, eh. But it was, the quality of the show and the performance, the performers, the music, everything. I was like, this is legit. Yeah. These guys are. And it was in an amphitheater, so like the characters <laughs> came out and interacted with the audience. Yeah. And gave the kids candy. Yeah, so that was fun. Lots of different fun stuff. Um. How was the rides from there? There was there's a good amount of rides. Yeah, there was that helicopter ride. Boy. Oh, the boat ride. <laughs> I got to go on that one. Hi. Um, yeah, we just went on a random airplane ride. Um, yeah, Manaya liked that one. It like it just goes in a circle and then it whips around. Yeah. And um, he was actually lifting his hand for that one. It was so cute. Oh uh, yeah. I was like telling That's him, "Papa, you want?" And he was all for it and he was enjoying it. So. All right, y'all. Well, that concludes part two, and uh, we just have so much to talk about that we don't want to keep going. We want to break this down into. Uh, little parts for you little bite-sized chunks mm -hmm. so <laughs> um we got more to discuss in part three coming up part three be looking out like subscribe so you can be the first one to be notified and comment on it but we appreciate you guys and until next time aloha